Hi everyone, welcome back to Drawn to Life. We last left off, we had just rescued Pirate Beard, and what I did in between is I donated to the well. I donated 3,000, I believe, so we're up to 5,000 now. We got 10 extra lives and another stamp, and I wanted to check out Isaac's shop, because I think we have a few other things we can buy there, including a, uh, not any of these patterns, but I think we can buy another color palette. Yep, tropical. We'll acquire that, and I think there's an ability. Yeah, we unlocked the dash ability. We don't have enough for that, though, so we'll just pass on that for now. But I'll see you back at the dock. All right, here we are. Mayor, what have you got for us? Oh, I might be young, but I can still adventure with the best of them. Thank you for your input, Mayor. Ah, Wolvox, welcome. The lighthouse is over there, as we saw in the flashback. Well, there it is. Now it's up to the creator to design the lighthouse. We'll draw a new one. Alright, I think it's a fairly tropical looking lighthouse. That'll get the job done. Hopefully be able to steer that ship into port. And stop the pirate invasion, hopefully. Alright. Let's see this thing in action. And, well... I guess we don't get to see it in action, we get to see the ship move though. And it worked. What do you think? Yar, tis a fine vessel. Oh, it's Mari. Yar, fine lass. How would Yar like to join my crew? Oh, she's out of here. Yar lass probably went to pack her things. Oh. Uh oh. It's boss time. Arg, Yar Angler King. Me crew is no match for a sea monster like that. Well, Vlox, you're our only chance. Head to the village island gate and you can sneak up behind the Angler King. Eee. Oh no. Oh, uh, hi there, Wilfrey. No. You're persistent. I'll give you that. Why do you continue to help these, these things? You're powerful. They don't deserve your help. Uh, well, I'm not gonna listen to you, Mr. Evil Guy, so no matter. It's almost time. I hope he doesn't sneak up from behind us. But, it's time for the end of World 3. 3-1 three, done. 3-2, three, 3-3, two, three, 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 4 3 boss The Angler King. What I think is probably the hardest boss in this game... Well, three, five. Let's get right into it. Oh, no. I am the Angler King. You dare invade my realm? Okay, this is where we, uh... Um, you just basically want to keep shooting him to hold him back. And this stage is just gonna kind of repeat itself, going down and up and down and up. So, you know, just be careful. Um, and try to swim, like, not too high up and kind of just in the center. And you should be able to hopefully keep most of your health. Um, well, we got it. We cut a little close there. Oh, yep. It's really hard to do, because they... Yeah, it's just, it loops for so long. Okay, 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 we beat him there. And we made it, alrighty. That was probably the best run I've done so far of that early part, but now we're on to stage two. Got you now. Do you? Okay, he's gonna shoot some of these fish at us. Um, these ones will take two hits to kill instead of one. Um, so just... Kind of be careful with them. But you shouldn't have too much problems. Yep, then we can take care of them. Okay, this is just not a big deal. And then he'll start swimming at us at uh, different levels. And we just want to shoot at him where we can. If we can get him. Okay, he's coming. There we go. And we'll take some damage. It's fine. Hopefully. Oh, uh, well, I'm not going to be that fine. Okay, yeah, drop us a heart, please. Okay, and we're out of ammo, so that's not good. We'll see how long we can stay alive. 
And, oh, we already lost our other health, and we have no ammo. Yeah, as you can see, this boss is not uh, very forgiving. But he'll start swimming around us now. So we just want to avoid him if we can. Oh, that was close. Yes, please, some ammo, a heart, anything. Thank you. Got him. Oh, he's gonna shoot more of his friends. That's not good. Okay, come on, come on. For, the, for these guys, we're gonna really just wanna avoid them now because we have no ammo. <laughs> I think we'll be able to swim around them for long enough. Um, uh, well, I don't think this is gonna go well. Uh, oh no. All right, well, you see you see the pattern. Oh no, oh no, no. Um, I'll be back when we have a better take. Rip. All right, this time it's going a little bit better. We can just get a shot on him. so close. Oh, but he's got to, of course, launch more of his fish buddies. Come on. Rather wait for him to come back so we can hopefully deal the remaining damage. Come on, we're so close. There we go. We got him. All right, that went a little bit better than I thought it would. Uh, just one additional take, but still not a fun boss by any means. And who's this guy? Looking like a, a little crazy. Just glad to be out of there. Hey, Mayor. Count Choco? Blah! The Wolvlax has rescued me. Erm, um, please don't scare anyone, okay? I'm starving. Does Shopkeep have Tavado juice? Uh, you can ask him. Bob, I will. There he goes. Are you sure we just want to leave him free in the village? Uh, I hope Count Choka doesn't scare the villagers. You stopped the Angler King? Yeah, he was uh, pretty tough, but we'll just, you know, lie and say he was a piece of filet. I figured you could handle it. Did you follow Count Choko? I'm worried he's going to cause trouble. Check near Isaac's shop. Well, it looks like Eyes of Shop is really popular right now, but Count Choco says, Blah, I want some Tavato juice. Uh, sure. Um, no Rappo coins? Blah? I don't know such a thing. I will give you this. Blah, I must go and feed. Uh, what did he hand over? Um, Wolbox, you should come see this. What a strange vampire. He traded me this page for some tomato juice. Tomato? 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 What is it, Isaac? I don't have a use for it. I'll sell it to you for a hundred Rappo coins. It's a, it's a page for the Book of Life. You should be giving it to us for free. What? I guess you could have it for free. You've been a good customer. Oh, okay. The mayor can put it back in the Book of Life. Even saving the world costs money. Visit the mayor. All right. Mayor, mayor, mayor. We've got a page from the Book of Life. Oh, where was he? Oh, he's probably still at the dock from the pirates. I'll see you up there. Did I say the dock? I am meant to say the gate. Hey there, mayor. Joko had a page from the Book of Life. How strange. Let me have a look. Hmm. The page is for a... Kaoran Berry Bush? Tell him to... Guess that's pronounced dangerous, but they could be useful. Wolvox, I'll meet you at the north of the village snow gate. We'll ask the creator to draw and plant some corn be uh, cornberry trees. Yeah, that's how we'll say it. We'll say cornberry. Okay. Hey there, villagers. Um, so you said just no north of the snow gate, so right about here. Yep. Ah, uh, the good old snow gate. Hey there. What? This looks like a good spot. Crater, could you draw and plant some uh, corn berry bushes? I'm gonna never stop <laughs> questioning how I pronounce that. 
Yes, yeah, so we'll draw and plant three of those. Let's design them real quick. All right, I think that's a good looking bush, but we're gonna need some berries on it. So we've had, uh, we've had Banya, which is a yellowish color in this game, or at least we've made it that way. And then we had uh, Cory berries, which we made red. So this, I think, will make them a little bit more of a blue. Uh, and we're also using our nice tropical color palette. So we'll make sure that there's enough berries on there, so it's reasonable. Yeah, it looks alright. And that's our bush, and we'll place uh, three of them down. So I think <laughs> I think that'll satisfy the village's needs, or at least our needs, since um, it seems like they're dangerous, and we're the only qualified person around here to do dangerous things. So drag and place three onto the field. One. Two. I like how this juts out a little, so that almost like they're trying to tell you that you should, like, place it just slightly off so that it looks a little bit better. But you can readjust them, but I think that looks good. I think we're all set. And? I need to speak with Samuel. The quarry berries can be dangerous if used improperly. Can you find Samuel and meet him at the villa- and, uh, tell him to meet me at the village hall? Yes. You should check near the village forest gate. Well, we'll go look for him. The mayor wishes to see me? Very well. I'll see you at the village hall. Yes, we'll sprint back there. And I, I imagine that soon enough we'll be clearing up the final area of the village. At long last. If Wolvox eats a corn berry, he'll double in size, but the effect is temporary. Temporary or not, he won't stand a chance in Rapoville without it. Rapoville? Wolvlox. There's only one section of the village covered in darkness. That village gate leads to Wilfrey. Cap the Eternal Flame and I'll meet you by the northeastern path. It leads to Rapoville. Alright, tap on the Eternal Flame. Um, most likely for what seems like the last time. For the northeastern section. And. We'll be back up there to clear those clouds. Alright, clouds cleared. And. Ah, the final section of our village. It's been a long time since I've seen the Rapoville World Gate. Let's take a look around. Yeah, let's, and let's hope that there's, you know, nothing suspicious. Explore the new section of the village. Okay, we'll just, you know, walk over, mosey over, see what's going on, and... Oh no. They're getting too close. I can't risk them finding me. Not before the task is finished. W what What task? You saw Wilfrey enter that gate? Well, it certainly doesn't look like the regular world gate. Hmm, this door has no color. We'll need the secret door page from the Book of Life. And then we can enter and stop Wilfrey. Wolvox, enter the Rapo City and secure the secret door page. Cornberry that you ate should take effect once you're in Rapo City. Well, it's time for our first new stage. Well, our first new stage of the Rapoville World Gate over here, farthest part of the village. Kind of forget about this gate sometimes because of how far out of the way it is, but. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and comment. If you want to see more, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when new content comes out. I'm Wolvlox, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.